Hi all, I'm getting ready to do some comparison videos against the Ape Light Maxi, the original, and this, the Ape Light Maxi 2.0 IP. And I was wondering if everybody knew what IP meant. No, this is not the answer to the question of what do you do in the restroom or what happens when you laugh way too hard. This is a different kind of IP. This IP stands for ingress protection. Ingress means, you know, stuff getting inside of it and protection is protection. So this particular light is IP65, which for those of you who really aren't interested in big explanations, it's rated for outdoor use. It's not gonna get dust inside of it, it's dust proof and rain and splashes aren't gonna hurt it. So that's what the IP in this case means. Website says IP65. And if that's all you wanted to know, thanks for watching, practice and enjoy. If you wanna know more, I'll read from Wikipedia here. The IP code or ingress protection code indicates how well a device is protected against water and dust. It is defined by the International Electrotechnical Commission, IEC, under the International Standard, IEC 60529, that's going to be on the test, which classifies and provides a guideline to the degree of protection provided by mechanical castings and electrical enclosures against intrusion, dust, accidental contact, and water. It is published in the European Union, for those of you in Europe, by the European Committee for Electrotechnical Standardization, and that's C-E-N-E-L-E-C, -E -E as, again, on the test, E-N-60529. I am not an electrical engineer. I am just a dummy DJ like a lot of you. Now, each digit means something. The six means something and the five means something. There's a chart. And if you go in the description of this video, I'll give you a link to this Wikipedia page that I'm looking at, and you can look at this chart for yourself. The first digit is six. And six means that it's dust tight. That's the six. Now, the second digit is five. So five as protection against water jets. There's more, and you're welcome to read it. Now, just because something has an IP rating doesn't mean that it's rated for outdoor use. You have to look at the numbers. 65, as I said, it's dust height, and it's relatively water resistant, rain, snow, things like that. I had these out in the snow a couple weeks ago. Got a video of it too, wasn't worried about it because it's IP65 rated. So that's it, just a quick video. I'm not gonna go in depth this much in my next video on the IP rating or the IP65 thing. Uh, I'll just mention it. Here's a video with more of an explanation. It could apply to many different lights. So that's it. If you wanna know more about it, go down, check the link uh, for Wikipedia. Again, I'm not an electrical engineer. I'm just a dumb DJ like um, a lot of you are. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Take care, practice, and enjoy.